Okay, so we got the static mix done so that everything at least sounds well balanced on playback. Uh, there's still a little more I like to do before I really kind of dig in and mix um, a little bit of editing here. So there's a plugin I like to use called Vocaline, which if you go up to Audio Suite, this would be if you had it installed, and go to Other, you can pull up Vocaline from there. So it's something we're going to apply it directly to the audio file. It doesn't go like on a track or on an aux or anything like that. It's actually going to uh, write a new audio file. Um, and so what this does is it'll, it'll kind of clean up the timing of vocals or guitars or, or really any audio if it's when it's uh, stacked or you get the ins and outs or anything like that. There's always going to be a little bit of variation where certain parts of a syllable don't really match up with the original. So this just automatically kind of moves the stacks and the ins and outs around to match the lead track. Um, this is one of those kind of secret weapon plugins. A lot of studios have it. Not everybody really knows about it, though. Um, I use it all the time, so that's why I wanted to kind of go over it in this video. Um, now, if you want to try it out, you can go to their website, SynchroArts.com. If you go to Products, they have two versions of Vocaline, Pro and Project. The one that I use is Project. Um, but if you download them, Project and Pro, they give you a full two-week working trial period of it. So if you want to follow along and actually do the vocal line with me as I'm doing it, then you can just download it from the Synchro Arts website and you'll have it for two weeks, full working version. And what's nice about that is because it is an audio suite plugin, we apply it directly to the audio file. Once that trial period's over, you don't lose the edits that you've done. All that stuff stays. Um, you just won't be able to do any new edits. All right. So I'm going to start with the Bubba Sparks tracks here. So I'm going to zoom in. And let's solo out the lead and the stack. That's the first two I'm going to work with. Not only does worry demonstrate a lack of faith, it also don't change nothing. That's a way so good, then it's no good. That's the break. Right. I like worry, stacking because it does make the vocal sound yep. thicker. Kept, I do. But you always but get a little bit of... Yeah, slide through. It starts getting a little harder to understand what's being said. And I've had some artists that will stack their vocals up you know, six, eight, ten times, and then it gets real difficult to understand, but again, that's the beauty of this vocal line plug in here. So let me start by uh, just bypassing these groups that I made so I can edit the tracks individually, because if they're on, then I can't edit them separately. They're kind of linked as if they're one track. So I'm going to turn off those groups, and let me go to slip mode. All right, and I'm just going to cut the clips right here. It's Command E or Control E on a PC. All right, and he stacks up. I believe just the entire verse. Demonstrate a lack of faith. It also don't change the that's the way. So good, then it's no good. That's the breaks. But ask me, do I still worry? I'ma have to say, yep, one hundred kept. I do, but I still persevere. Yeah, slide through. Anyone or anything that ever tried to derail me, you can't tell me. Not a thing. If I wanna dream, I'ma dream. Better yet, if I wanna do, I'm going to next move, best move. No more talk, just show, just prove. Yes, you. Yes, you. Yes, you. Okay, cool. So I just wanted to listen to it to make sure that every word was actually stacked because if he leaves one out, sometimes vocal line will kind of mess up the way it stretches this audio. All right, so one more thing before I actually process it. I'm going to go to the playlist here, and I'm going to duplicate my playlist on both tracks. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and do it on all four of these Bubba Sparks tracks. The reason I'm doing that is because it kind of gives me a little bit of an undo option. If I go in and, you know, go and do some edit and, like, delete a chunk of audio right there, I can always flip back to the original playlist and I still have the audio exactly as we imported it. So it's almost like doing a little save as um, on individual tracks. Okay, so the controls for vocal line are super, super simple. So I'm going to click on the lead track. Make sure I have guides selected here, and then hit capture, and then it's going to basically import that little bit of audio file onto the guide track. All right, then I'm going to go to the stack and select dub track. All right, dub and vocal line, capture the dub track. And then it's just a line, and it just kind of analyzes the difference between the two audio files and figures out how to line them up, and then hit spot, and it actually places it back on the track. Alright, so let's listen to 
the stacks now. Not only does worry demonstrate a lack of faith, it also don't change nothing. That's a waste. So good, then it's no good. That's the breaks. But ask me, do I still worry? I'ma have to say, yep, 100 kept, I do. But I still persevere, yeah, I slide through. Anyone or anything that ever tried to derail me, you can't tell me. Not a thing. If I want to dream, I'ma dream. Better yet, if I want to do, I'm going to. Next move, best move. No more talk, just show, just prove. Yes, you. Yes, you. Yes, you. Yeah, it just kind of tightens everything up. And to me, the main thing is that it makes it easier to understand the words, which when mixing vocals is really important to me. So that's one of the reasons I use vocal line a lot. Now, I'll even go in and I'll do the ins and outs and I'll align them off the lead too. So we're done with the stack for the moment. Demonstrate a lack of faith. It also don't change nothing. That's a waste. So good, then it's no good. That's the breaks. But ask me, do I still worry? I'm going to have to say, yep, 100 kept, I do. Right. So same idea. I'm just going to go in, zoom in on these parts, cut them. And then guide track capture, just this one word in this case. Dub track on the in and out, and I already duplicated the track, so I'm good. Capture the dub, align, spot, dub track again, capture, align, spot. Not only does worry demonstrate a lack of faith, it also don't change nothing. That's a waste. So right, I'll do it one more time here on the, the waste just to show you, and then I think I'm just going to kind of Fast forward through all this editing because this will be super boring to try and watch me do all this. Way so good, then it's so good. Yeah, so again, guide track, capture, dub track, capture, align, spot for the first in and out. And then for the second one, just capturing the dub track again, align, spot. All right, this plugin saves a lot of time. If you're trying to do all this manually by hand, it's probably take hours. Change nothing. That's a way so good. Then All right, and then I can delete like these little chunks here in between where we might have like some headphone bleed and that kind of stuff. So um, going through this process, not only am I kind of correcting the timing, but I'm also cleaning up the background tracks and getting rid of all the empty noise too. Kind of two birds with one stone kind of deal, right? And then with Pro Tools, because I'm chopping up this vocal track, it's kind of a nice thing. Since I haven't really changed anything, I've just been chopping it up. If you hit Command H, or again Control H if you're on PC, you can heal all those cuts you made so I can still get back and have a kind of a cleaner looking track. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and finish up this uh, Bubba Sparks verse and I'm just going to fast forward through the editing as I do this. Okay, so now we got it all done. So we got all this extra just blank audio here we can get rid of the beginning of these Bubba Sparks tracks. Okay, and then remember this lead track I never actually changed. I didn't edit anything on there, so Command H, I'm just gonna heal up all those cuts that I made. And let's go ahead and give a listen to the now vocalined version of the verse and let's just make sure I didn't mess anything up or vocaline didn't get you know a little confused on anything so go ahead and turn my groups back on I'm gonna turn these in and outs up a little bit so I can hear them just as loud as the leads hey. 
Riot, hey, 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 hey. Not only does worry demonstrate a lack of faith, it also don't change nothing. That's a waste. So good, then it's no good. That's the breaks. But ask me, do I still worry? I'ma have to say, yep, 100 kept, I do. But I still persevere, yeah, I slide through. Anyone or anything that ever tried to derail me, you can't tell me. Not a thing. If I want to dream, I'm a dream. Better yet, if I want to do, I'm going to. Next move, best move. No more talk, just show, just prove. Yes, you. Yes, you. Yes, you. Bubba K. Hey, Riot. Hey, hey. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Sounds nice and smooth. Everything sounds clean. Go ahead and pull these in and outs back down a little bit. Hide these groups and stuff. All right, so good on those Bubba Sparks tracks. Make sure I hit Command S and save. Now there's some ins and outs on the um, verses. Rat Phoenix here, so let me listen to those. I might want to clean those up with some vocal line also. Growing up, I was a black sheep. I thought no one could understand me. People looking at me like I'm crazy. Mama begging God to save me, but I know I had a purpose. I do the trouble that delay we put on there. I'm just a young dream chaser. Gonna be a young trailblazer. Alright, well I'm gonna go ahead and do vocal line on these tracks as well. So again, I'm going to duplicate all my playlists first, just in case I realize later on maybe I made a mistake with vocal line or I want to get back to the original file. I still can. And there's some of these harmonies also. Okay, all of the tracks have been duplicated, so I'm just going to go through the same process I did on the Bubba Spark stuff. So basically chop out the sections that I want to align, which is Command E. Pull up my vocal line plugin under Audio Suite. Other. All right. Capture the lead. Capture the dub. Align spot, and then another dub. Capture, align spot, and. That should be it. Going up, I was a black sheep. I. No. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go through and do all of the uh, the verses and the harmonies here. But again, just to save time, I'm gonna go ahead and kind of fast forward through this stuff because uh, it could be really boring to try and watch me edit all this stuff in real time. Okay, that should be the first verse. Get rid of all this empty audio now. Okay. Go ahead and heal the lead track, because again, I didn't really change anything, but kill some of this blank audio we got in here also. All right, so let's hear how the verse sounds now. Growing up, I was a black sheep. I thought no one could understand me. People looking at me like I'm crazy. Mama begging God to save me. But I know I had a purpose. I knew the struggle would be worth it. I'm just a young dream chaser. Gonna be a young trailblazer. Okay. That sounds pretty good. All right, so... There's a couple of the last little tweaks. Oh, that's the only time those harmonies play. So we just need that one little chunk there. Cool. Um... So, fades. <laughs> um, all those chops that I did can add little clicks and pops and that kind of stuff into the audio. Because um, I wasn't really being super careful as far as where my chops were being made. I was just trying to line it up with the lead. Um, so if you just highlight all of the regions that you've edited and you hit Command F or Control F if you're on a PC, it brings up this batch fades dialog. So... Um, what I'm looking for here now is creating new fade ins and creating new fade outs. They don't need to be long, just like these are just 10 milliseconds, just enough, or if there is a little click, um, it'll just kind of smooth that out with the, the fade in and the fade out. 
I don't need any crossfades on this. I'm gonna turn that off. And just hit OK. And then if we zoom in, we can see Pro Tools just automatically put these little fade ins and fade outs on every audio clip for us. Alright, and that's basically it. So now the, the first verse and the third verse, although let me go in and put in my fades on this stuff also. And all my settings that I just set are still in the fades menu, so I can just hit OK. So now I've got all my fades on my Bubba Sparks edits that I made. Okay. And that's pretty much it. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go through and vocal line this third, or sorry, the second verse here. This will be the third verse I'm actually editing, but this is the second verse. I'm going to go ahead and vocal line these little ins and outs right here. And that's basically it. We'll call it for this video. Um, and then the next one, we'll do some, uh, probably look at Melodyne in the next video. All right. So go ahead, go to the Synchro Arts website. Go ahead and download a um, demo version. Like I said, it's a full working version for two weeks. And just kind of mess with it. See if this is getting the results you're looking for um, in your songs as well. Gonna be a young trailblazer